In this video, I'm going to answer the question, how much can I save if I install attic foil radiant barrier in my attic? And the answer is it could be as little as 5% or it could be more than 30%. There's so many variables, it's really hard to pin down. But let me explain why. Your house basically is just a big box sitting in the sun. Heat's coming in from all directions, but you have a disproportionate amount of heat coming in from the hot roof. Radiant barrier helps reflect that heat coming in the top of the box. So if you've got a one-story ramp style home with a large roof or a lot of surface area, it's going to have a lot bigger impact than if you have a two-story home with a relatively smaller roof or attic and you might have a bunch of windows that catch afternoon sun. This doesn't mean that you should not install a radiant barrier in a two-story home with a relatively small attic. It just means that your potential savings are less than if you had a similar size home as far as square footage and it was a large one-story ranch style. Now, bang for the buck, you can't beat radiant barrier. If your roof catches sun, you've got radiant heat coming in that top floor, whether it be on the second floor of a two-story home or on the first floor of a one-story ranch style. Putting radiant barrier in the attic is almost like putting a shade tree over the roof part of the home. You want to reject that heat before it ever even gets into the home. If you can keep the heat out, you don't have to spend money on air conditioning, which is really just the removal of heat. I hope this answers your question as far as how much a radiant barrier will save. For more information about radiant barrier, visit HaddockFoil.com.